All right, here's a quick video on how to change a cassette. Now, technically I already changed this cassette. The problem was the video didn't turn out, so I'm just gonna do it again. Um, in order to swap a cassette, you're gonna need a cassette tool, either one like this that's hollow or one that has a guide pin that goes in the middle. Both will work. And you're gonna need a cassette chain tool, basically. So in order to chain a cassette, now this is a SRAM cassette, XX1 uh, 1199. Cassette tool goes in the middle, right? Problem is, you need to uh, turn it counterclockwise, and when you do that, the cassette spins backwards, right? Hence why we need a cassette chain tool. So the cassette chain tool, we apply it on the larger rings, get as many teeth as you can, in order to get as much force as possible on here, right? Then take a ratchet. Put them in here, and now we can turn them counterclockwise. And there you go. We unscrew them, right? So, once he's done, there we go. We're able to pop out our cassette straight up, right? So, when it comes to putting in a new cassette, what you want to do. One, there's threads, and this is an XD driver. There's threads on the XD driver, and you wanna clean those threads best you can, basically, right? Get any dirt off those threads and this entire area, actually, if you can. Okay, so now this was already cleaned. Then, on your new cassette, what you wanna do is the threads on the inside over here, you want to lightly grease those threads on the inside. Now typically also, if you can see it, there's a Teflon ring, right, where your small cogs are. You wanna put a little bit of grease on a Teflon ring because sometimes cassettes squeak. Typically, that's where the squeak comes from. So you put a little bit of grease in there as well, right? Then when you're all greased up, take the cassette and plop it right back on there, okay? Take your cassette tool by hand Try and thread it in to make sure we don't strip. Just like that. Always by hand first, right? And then it's gonna get to a point you won't be able to do it by hand. And use a ratchet, screw it down best you can. But we will have to torque this down as well. Okay, now it's getting a little hard. Now for XX1 cassettes, or at least most SRAM cassettes, 24 Newton meters. Twenty-four. So, put it in here. Come on, get in there. What the? There we go. Take them. Make sure your torque wrench is straight. Make sure you grab your torque wrench at the end, not like this, not like that. Right at the end with your palm. All right, and then torque them down until there we go. Twenty-four point two. So that's how we replace a cassette. Hope this helps uh, some beginners out there. Like, subscribe, dislike, add any comments below. And uh, looking forward to the next videos. Have a great day. Take care.